topic we cover today is bag technique. So if we talk about the bag technique, it is the uh, public health bag that is used to perform the various health procedures or the nursing procedures that is carried by the uh, nurse when she used to go in the uh, community areas or the home visits or in the schools or factories for the various health checkups or the procedures. So uh, bag technique uh, is the procedure that is that comes under the community procedures that helps in that helps the community to get uh, various kinds of uh, nursing cares by this bag technique and the nurse that goes to the home visits or that goes to the community or the field visits that takes her that takes the bag with herself for the various kinds of procedures the nurse usually takes the bag in the shoulders or in the hands or keep the bag in the sterile or the clean place the bag should be commonly made up of with the canvas or the light metal or with the leather. The next if you talk about the bag technique is its, is its importance. The importance of the bag technique is that bag technique bag is used to uh, carry out the various kinds of uh, equipments and materials that are used for the nursing care in the community areas or the field visits or for the home visits. Usually the bag technique is a kind of uh, uh, vehicle that is used to take off with the to take the various kinds of materials that are used in the community areas for the various nursing procedures. Next if we talk about the principles of the bag techniques, the principles includes the uh, first principle that is very much important that is the cleanliness. The cleanliness is the first principle of the bag technique that should be maintained throughout the procedure and also before and after the procedure. Next if you talk about the next uh, principle of the bag technique that is the uh, maintenance of the uh, maintenance of the procedure and maintenance of the handling of the bag. The bag should be carefully handled and the hand washing should be done before and after touching the articles and the, uh, and the uh, overall bag should be cleaned. The bag should be properly disinfected at the various several times uh, during the procedures and the bag should not be uh, kept in the contaminated area during the use of procedure or the during the home visits or in the community visits. Next if we talk about the next principle of the uh, bag technique that is the bag should not be unnecessarily touched even when it is not in used. Uh, if the bag is completely uh, in the use the bag should be placed at the clean area and also the bag should be closed and properly covered with the uh, with the cover of the bag. Then uh, then next we, if we move towards the uh, uh, contents of the bag technique the bag contains so many of the materials like uh, they are included they contains uh, scissors newspaper soap soap dish and the uh, forceps artery forceps cotton pads sterile pads some of the medicines the bag the bag is contained like uh, benedict solutions betadine savillon solutions and the uh, antibiotics so these are the medicines that are uh, contained or the equipped in the bag for the various kinds of procedure next if you talk about the compartments of the bag technique so there are five compartments in the bag bag technique like the first compartment is the first or the front pocket in which the nail brush nail cutter and soap dish and soap is placed. In the next compartment is the right right portion of the bag that, that is equipped with the newspaper and the stationeries and the right compartment of the bag is equipped with the family folders, pen, diary and the uh, upper upper compartment is the is also known as a sterile compartment where the sterile uh, equipment or the ster sterile materials are equipped like uh, um, like uh, artery forceps, sterile gauge pads, cotton pads and the medicines or the antibiotics or the syringes and injections. Next is the last compartment or the fifth compartment that is the lower compartment in which the clean equipments are equipped like uh, the clean equipments include like uh, the like the newspaper uh, like the um, sample collection box, urine collection kits and the various kinds of test tubes, test tube holders like these kinds of uh, common and the clean equipments are equipped in the lower portion of the bag. Next if we talk about the procedure of this bag technique, the procedure should be continuously pro pro uh, completed in the manner, manner, manner like the 
uh, when the nurse is going in the community area the nurse should take the bag in on her shoulder or keep the bag within within her hand the next is when the nurse used to keep the bag in the community area she have to first decide the area or the location where she have to complete the procedure or the procedure that is she is that she used to do she have to select the particular area the area should be the area should be cleaned and uh, should be disinfected and next after the selection of the area the next important thing is that to place the bag in the floor the bag should be placed before placing the newspaper or the plastic uh, plastic mat on the plastic mat or the on or on the newspaper the bag should only be placed not without newspaper or not without the plastic mat the bag should be placed directly on the mat, directly on the floor the next step is to hand wash the hand wash the hand washing procedure should should be done before starting the procedure and after the completion of the procedure the nurse should uh, take off the newspaper place the bag and go for the go for the hand washing by removing off by taking off the hand washing articles she should hand wash her properly and at the by the running water or at the uh, running water the next step is to uh, keep that articles at the place of hand washing and come back to the uh, to the uh, particular area where she have selected the where she have selected to complete the procedure next she have to uh, take off the next newspaper or the plastic mat for which to um, to place down the articles for which the uh, nurse nurse is going to complete the procedure the articles required she must be take off the articles and keep on the uh, plastic mat or the newspaper the next step is to complete the procedure and close the bag properly and secure the bag the next after completing the procedure the articles must be disinfected and uh, and cleaned properly or if the if the washing of the uh, articles is uh, available there she must wash wash the equipments and clean and dry them and keep or replace the articles in the bag according to their respective compartments next after replacing the after replacing the equipment she have to uh, note down all the procedures in the record book or the if she have to complete the family floor folder she have to complete at the time and after replacing that all equipment she have to clean the bag and keep the newspaper fold Uh, the the area of the exposure of the newspaper should be folded inside because it may prevent the cross infections or the contamination of the bag the next uh, step is recording and reporting at the last she have to record and report the procedure what she have done and uh, how she have done what she have noticed and what implementation she she has completed so this was all about the bag technique i hope you all have understood So this is Sonal Gautam signing off till we meet in next video thank you class